So at this point, we've installed WordPress. We've installed the king size theme. Now we're going to import the demonstration content. Basically what this does is it creates a replica of the kingsizetheme.com website. This is our demonstration. This is going to help you get started by importing demo content that you can refer to and reference while building your own website. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to log into our WordPress dashboard. And once logged in, we're going to go to Tools and we're going to go to Import. Once on the import page, we're going to see WordPress at the bottom of the list. We're going to want to install the WordPress importer. Click install now. And we want to activate the plugin and run the importer. Now we're going to choose the included demo content file. This is called expressinstall.xml. So to choose this file, we need to click the Choose File button. We need to locate our king size WordPress, the current version from ThemeForest. Inside there, we're going to locate the Extras folder. And in the Extras folder, we're going to find expressinstall.xml. Let's hit Choose, Upload File, and Import. On this next page, we can import the author, our web media or we can create a new user with login name or a signpost to an existing user. If we want to import the images, we check the download and import file attachments. Once ready, we hit submit. Once the import is done, it'll say all done, have fun. Remember to update the passwords and roles of any imported users. So we can go back to the front end of our website where we last left off in the last video and we can see that it's still the exact same. There's no menu yet assigned. So what we need to do is we need to go back to our WordPress dashboard. We need to go to Appearance and Menus. We can see that there's already two menus imported, the footer menu and the primary navigation. We want to manage our menu locations and we will see header navigation. We will select a menu and use the primary navigation which was just imported. We will hit save changes. We can go back to the front end of our website. We can refresh the page and we will now see that our menu as well as new slider images from the import are available on the home page. In our next tutorials we'll further explain the use of the navigation as well as other features and options with King Size WordPress. If you require any buyer support, we recommend you register for our support forms by visiting ourwebmedia.com support.